our new term is either going to go into the fourth or the sixth term position. Well, if we look at it closely, we can see that the 10.8 is below the 11, okay? Or the 10.5 is below the 11. So this would mean that the, um, the value will go in below here. So that's the first step. And if we look at the actual result, okay, of the, the mean between the ten between the eleven and the other value is ten point five. So if we look back, it's pretty straightforward that this value must be ten, because ten plus eleven over two is ten point five, or ten point five is halfway between the two values, so it's the mid mid value. Okay. So that works out as the additional term will be the fourth term with number 10. All right, so finally, we have to look at the permutations of three groups. The first group has three subjects. The group B has four and group C has five. So we want to um, see how many permutations Ben can make when he's choosing a subject. So he can choose one from each. So, um, everybody's seen this one before. So, 3 by 4 by 5. Okay, are the numbers in each group. So, you can choose his three options, four options, and five options in the successive groups. So, that will give 60 overall choices. Okay, so the next part is just adding in a value. <laughs> to one of the groups okay so we're going to add in um the value to the first group and let's see what happens so if we add in uh, the uh, one to the first group we'll get four options and the other two will stay the same okay so that would give us 80 choices so we want to find the largest group so that's an option but we got to exhaust all avenues okay we've got to check them all out so let's add one subject into the second group so that would then go up to five wouldn't it so we have four plus one and then again multiply by five okay so let's see what we get and we're going to get three by five by five is 75 choices so just to be sure we go on to the next one three by four and a five now group group c will become a six so three by four by six is 72. so group a is the answer so i really like that question in this year's 2022 exam um it would have given people a possibility to get get a lot of marks there and bump up their scores so again, thank you for joining Maths Plus. Give the, the video a thumbs up and check out the following videos, which I'll be doing on the 